Hi everybody, it's Avalon. I'm here at the park with my grandson. Say hi. Hi. <laughs> um, I want to talk to you really quick about um, something that, you know, I, I read on Facebook today about how it was a meme and it said, um, I am um, honest or, you know, I share my recovery for those who can't, or those who are are hiding, and those who are still in active addiction. It was kind of along those lines, and um, and it just made me start to think about how, in the beginning, when people would confront me about my addiction, how I lied and and just tried to cover it up, and you know, it was because it was embarrassing, like it was humiliating for me to think about myself being an addict and that that I was out of control you know that I was powerless because I hadn't lied in my head and, and told myself that I wow good job you went fast how I lied and I was I was ashamed and I couldn't look at myself as being an addict I had, I had it all justified and rationalized in my head and it was embarrassing to be confronted and so I'm vocal about my addiction and my recovery because somebody will turn on my video and I hope that it causes them to not feel so alone wow good job how it will make them feel like you know, it's okay to admit that we've lost control. It's okay to admit that we, it, you know, something got away from us. And it's okay that we need help. You know, a lot we need help with a lot of things in our life. And addiction should, should not be shameful. Addiction should not be um, something to be ashamed of. And there's, you know, like, you'd be shocked, you know, you, you see people at Walmart, you see, you see people out and about, and you'd be shocked at how many of them are addicts. You know, whether they're alcoholics, secret alcoholics, secret, you know, opiate addicts, or met, whatever it is, you'd be shocked because it is so prevalent. There are so many people out there that are addicts and alcoholics that don't look the part. I didn't look the part. And that's how I got away with it as long as I did. Um, and I had enablers that helped me in my addiction. And so I just want everybody to know that there's nothing to be ashamed of. There's nothing to be embarrassed about. And that seeking help should not make us feel like... We are less than. I see that we are less than or that we have something to hide about. We don't. And, to, you know, I am an addict. I, there are many things that, that I did that I'm ashamed of that I have, you know, it took me a long time to admit. Using drugs with my own children is one of them. And to, to come out and to say that, um, was humiliating for me, but that just goes to show that I see that just goes to show the depths that addiction will take us. And in, you know, come forward now, admit it now, and get help now. The you, running from it is not going to help any. Um, you're not going to get better on your own. And you need help. So, the sooner you could do it, the sooner we can, you can get on with your recovery, and it's worth it. It's hard, but it's worth it. It's a worth it kind of hard. You know what I'm saying? And so, all right, well, I'm going to spend time with my grandson, and uh, I hope you're all having a good day. Brightest blessings and God is blessed.